Now here we learn some properties of ACF and LCM. Right. It is helps to solve the different kind of math regarding this chapter. Right student. So first properties A for any two numbers. In that case we find out the ACF into LCM is equal to product of the two numbers right now we as the ACF of 2 crow prime number is 1 therefore LCM of 2 crow prime is equal to product of the crow primes right number C the ACF of the given numbers cannot be greater than either of the numbers. Number D. The LCM of the given numbers cannot be less than either of the numbers. So, try to understand by the given example. Example number 1. Right. So here the question verify that the product of 84 and 110 is equal to the product of their HCF and LC. Okay. So how to find out this problem? So let's try to find out the problem of the given. Right. So we write prime prime factorize factorize 84 and and 110 110 to get to get 84 is equal to 2 into 2 into 3 into 7 and 110 is equal to we write here 2 into 5 into 11 okay therefore ACF of of 84 and 110 is equal to 2 okay and and LCM LCM is equal to is equal to of the given number 84 and 110 is equal to 2 into 2 into 3 into 7 into 5 into 11 okay now multiply this all number properly that to get here 4620 right now 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 we use the formula a right as you know the lcm as you know for any two numbers the acf into lcm is equal to product of the two numbers here we apply here okay so as we know as as we know no no ACF into LCM is equal to product of two number product of of two number right so write the formula over here two into four thousand six hundred twenty is equal to 84 into 84 into 110 right thus here we find out here we find out like this way so this one this one implies 900 sorry 9000 
forty. This one also nine thousand two hundred forty. Okay, right. So thus, thus we can write. Thus we can write. HCF into LCM of eighty four and an hundred ten is equal to eighty four into hundred ten is equal to nine thousand two hundred forty. Clear. I hope you clearly understood what I discuss over here, right, student? Hope. Next, I will discuss the another math. Dear student, we discuss the another example regarding this chapter. Here, given a problem, the ACM and LCM of the two numbers is twenty. And two hundred eighty, respectively. Okay, if one of the number, one of the numbers is forty, find the other numbers. So let's try find out the solution. Okay, here solution. First of all, we write as you know, as we know. As you know, ACF into LCM is equal to product, product, product of two numbers, right? So here, using this formula, we write therefore. Twenty into two hundred eighty is equal to forty into required number. Required number, right? Now, now so so the required. Number is equal to twenty into two eight zero by forty. So this one two and this one forty zero. Now we get one hundred forty. Okay. So therefore, the required number. Therefore, the the required required number number is one hundred forty. This is the answer of this problem, right, student? Here we discuss the another problem regarding this chapter. So here the problem is given. Find the greatest four-digit number which is divisible by eight, twelve, and thirteen. It is so easy math. I think you can easily solve this math. But let's try to solve this math here, right, student? So let's let's find the Find the LCM of eight, twelve, and thirty. Right. So we do LCM over here. Eight, twelve, thirty. First, we take two. This one four, four. Four, this one six, and this one fifteen. Now again we take two. This one two. This one three. This one fifteen. Right. Then again we take three. 
now this one 2 this one 1 this one 5 correct therefore therefore LCM of 8 12 and 13 and 13 is equal to 2 2 into 2 into 2 into 3 into 2 into 2 into 5 2 into 3 into 2 into 2 into 5 that means 4 4 8 8 24 and 5 jam 120 correct so the greatest as you know the the greatest four digit number greatest greatest four digit number number is 9999 okay let's check let's check let's check check if it is divisible divisible by by 120 or not right so 900 9999 divisible by 120 okay so we do division over here this one 9999 divided by 12 so we take this one 8 8 8 that will come 0 and 96 so here we subtract this one will come 3 99 right so we take 3 here this one 360 now subtract the remainder will be 39 okay so so gives gives 39 as the as the remainder remainder right therefore the required number therefore the required required number number is equal to 9999 minus 39 so we get 9960 this one answer okay I hope student you clearly understood. So please like, share and give comment and don't forget to subscribe my channel. Thank you for watching this video. Here we are going to be solve a problem like find the greatest number which will divide 2132 and 1141 leaving the remainders 4 and 1 respectively right so the solution is here we write as as 2132 minus 4 is equal to 2128 and and 1141 minus 1 is equal to 1 1140 right so first we require the number a shape of the required the required required number is the HCF of two thousand 
128 and 1140 right so we do the issue by the division method so 21281140 we take 1 1 1 4 0 then it will come this one 8 this one 8 and 9 so this one divisible 1 1 4 0 then we take 1 okay so we write here we write here this one 9 8 8 right so subtract this one 152 we can we divide this one this one 9 8 8 divided by 152 so it became 6 we take 6 then it will come 912 now subtract this one 76 so 152 it easily divisible by 76 then it will come so there is no remainder so therefore 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 the required number for the required required number is 76 that one answer right i hope student you clearly understood